Whether you know him as Superman or Geralt the Witcher, you can't help but love Henry Cavill. Since hitting the big screens in the early 2000s, Cavill has become one of the biggest actors in the industry. Although he is well known both for his roles and his stunning good looks, there is still plenty that is not known about the actor. Here are 10 things you didn't know about Henry Cavill. He's fluent in four languages. Mastering another accent is already tough enough for the average person, let alone a whole other language. But Henry Cavill is not your average man. He's actually fluent in four languages, English, Spanish, French and Italian. His deep interest in different cultures is probably the reason for his eclectic language skills. Bullying inspired his career choice. Henry Cavill had a tough childhood just like everyone else, except he turned his hard times into something great. He grew up in the UK, where his father worked as a stockbroker. He was an unpopular student in school and was bullied because he was fat. He commented in an interview that other kids had nasty names for him, including Lemon and Fat Cavill. He then decided to play rugby as a way of staying in shape and also started acting to gain his confidence. The two hobbies later helped him become the actor he is today. Stephanie Meyer wanted him to play Edward Cullen. After seeing Cavill as Albert Mondego in 2002's The Count of Monte Cristo, author Stephanie Meyer based her description of Edward Cullen and Twilight on him. She would have loved to have Cavill to play the role, but by the time the movies were made, he was too old to play a 17-year-old, so it instead went to Robert Pattinson. Missed roles. Interestingly enough, he also had an interest of playing Cedric Diggory in Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire, but that role also went to Robert Pattinson. Then in 2005 he came very close for the role of James Bond in Casino Royale and made it to a final screen test before being told he was too young, causing producers to go with Daniel Craig instead. Before landing his Man of Steel role, Cavill was first considered for Superman in 2006's Superman Returns, but the role was given to Brandon Routh. This string of missed roles caused Empire Magazine to call Cavill the most unlucky man in Hollywood in 2005. He almost missed out on playing Superman. It is hard to imagine Henry Cavill as anyone other than Superman, which is why this simple mistake is so astonishing. Cavill has an addiction to the online PC game World of Warcraft, which he was playing in team mode when the director for Superman, Man of Steel called him. He explained to Jay Leno that you can't pause the game, so, when director Zack Snyder called to confirm he had gotten the role, he ignored it. Obviously, he called him back and the rest is history. Becoming the Witcher. Cavill has many hobbies, but none beat his love for comic books and video games. When he stopped playing rugby, he embarked on reading comic books, which is probably why he is such a good Superman. He also plays lots of video games. His love for the games helped him land the role of Geralt in The Witcher, as he had already been playing the game long before the production of the Netflix series began. He contacted the producer immediately for the role when he heard that a series was being produced about the game, and luckily for him, he landed the part. Staying in shape. The physique is a major factor in most of the roles Cavill plays, which is why he needs to stay in shape. He has a personal fitness trainer who helps him develop his body and keep it in shape. The trainer said they based his physique off of actor Steve Reeves, who played Hercules in the 1958 film Hercules. Cavill is also athletic and participates in lots of marathons and sports, including occasional rugby, which has helped maintain his fit body. He has been named one of the sexiest men in the world. His love for animals. Henry Cavill has long been an animal rights activist, especially championing the protection of endangered species. While his website mostly promotes the conservation of gorillas, he himself preferred adopting something smaller, a bat called Ben. He is the spokesman for the Durrell Wildlife Conservation Trust for which he holds fundraising events, including marathons. He also has a dog named Cal. His dream role. Henry Cavill has simple but really huge dreams. After playing Superman and Gerald, most fans would assume he has had his best life, but it turns out he hasn't. Cavill said in an interview that his dream role is to play Alexander the Great. He also said that his favorite movie is Gladiator, which explains his great performance in The Witcher. He was the fan favorite for Fifty Shades of Grey. When it was announced that the Fifty Shades of Grey series was coming to theaters, fans were quick to make assumptions about who would be playing the role of Christian Grey. The fan fave was, by far, Henry Cavill, but the role ended up going to Jamie Dornan. 
The two actors do bear a striking resemblance to each other, though, 